Yo, so whether you need gunpowder to progress your age or to run around like Rambo, gunpowder has always been slow to farm. So I'm going to show you a beginner and an advanced method to farm gunpowder. Now I really hope this guide helps you. Please do drop a like and subscribe. Join the Discord, all the links are down below, but let's do this. So as I mentioned, I'm going to be showing you two methods. A beginner method that can be done as soon as you start the game, meaning it can be done before the age of fire, so it's perfect for age progression. And an advanced method that's super fast, so perfect for mass producing. So let's start with the beginner method. Now I only recommend doing this method to progress your age. Once you have progressed to the age of fire, move on to the advanced method. So for this method, we are going to use my ultimate farm technique. So first, you need the skill structural mechanic. So with this skill, you will gain a chance to retrieve a portion of the building's materials when constructing a building. So what this means is when you place down a build, there's a small chance to get the resources it took to craft that build back. Now this skill can be found in tier two of the living skill tree. You will need a minimum of eight skill points to unlock and max this skill. But don't worry about using up skill points. You can easily reset at the top of the skill tree. And even when you have max amount of skill points, it only costs 100,000 gold. And if that sounds like a lot of gold, I recommend checking out a money farm. You will also need some conveyor belts. You can use regular or high speed. Now you can either craft these conveyor belts, or you can just go up to Anubis's platform on Beginner Island and it's surrounded by conveyor belts. You're also going to need some slopes. You can use wood or stone. Now once you have all of that, you are also going to want a level 3 island with a merchant and possibly a few prisms. We're going to head to the level 3 island and we're going to throw down our merchant. Now we're going to check the stock and we're looking for fireworks. If your merchant has no fireworks, just capture him in a prism, throw him back down and his stock will change. Just keep going until you find a stack of 100 fireworks and purchase as many as you can. Now let's head to any flat piece of land, beginner island will do, and let's start placing down our conveyor belt so it creates a loop back to our character. Now go ahead and place your slope above just like this. Now we can send in our fireworks and stack up our gunpowder. Now one thing to keep in mind, if you are on Xbox or Windows, you have an item floor limit of 32 items. Meaning with the spillage from this beginner method, it's very easy for our items to start disappearing. Now you can simply improve upon this build by simply walling off the conveyor belt, placing down a fan to ensure all spillage is pushed on the track. But it isn't needed, just make sure you collect your spillage before it builds up too much. Of course, if you are on Steam with the max item floor limit, it setting, let it rip. So now onto the advanced method. Thanks to the amazing pet update that gave us over 40 new pets, including bosses, we can now capture a lizard gunner. And by simply throwing a lizard gunner into a livestock machine, the gunpowder will produce like crazy. So to capture a lizard gunner, you are going to need a minimum of four chain restraint bullets. And to find a lizard gunner, you are either going to need to find an ancient tomb or in room eight of boss rush dungeon. You can then set up healing to keep the lizard gunner alive, throw on a bunch of droppers firing into a large storage container, and boom, gunpowder for your picture book and to fulfill those Rambo fantasies. Now there is a rumor that the speed that the lizard gunner produces gunpowder is going to be nerfed so you may want to stock up while it's super fat. But even if the nerf does happen, it's still AFK and it's still a lot faster than producing it through poop. But again, it's just a rumor, nothing official. Now, I really hope this guide helped you. Please do drop a like and subscribe. Join the Kaz Gang Discord for all your Craftopia needs. But most importantly, enjoy the rest of your day. Stay safe and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Listen.